Yeah, so I had to work last night. So St. Patty's Day wasn't completely what I would have wanted, but... So, St. Patty's Day was yesterday. Um, did some drinking. Of course, you know. Give me a reason to drink. Anyways, uh, went down to the pub, the local pub, you know, the actual Irish pub. Just because, you know, you wear a lot of green necklaces and green antennae and glasses and pins and colored green and socks with different little logos on them. Doesn't mean shit on fucking St. Patty's Day. All right. And, um, three weeks. I guess we are a lot more hardcore than I ever thought. Because the fat Aussie bastard could only last three weeks. Now, he's a busy guy. I completely understand that. But at the same time, you know, fat Aussie, dude. Um, yeah, I'm working 40 plus hours a week, go to school three days a week, eight hours each day, uh, trying to be a husband, um, take care of my grandmother one day a week, the whole day, do a live blog TV show, then I go to Cinder's show, till whenever, I also do my YouTube videos, and I'm doing these videos for Five Awesome Drunks. Oh yeah, I also have another project in the works, and a lot of people, this is going to be about 30 plus people involved in it. Um, nothing like big TV, I'll give you that, okay. It's alright, you know, but just saying guys, okay, I'm just, I'm just saying, you know, you, I thought you would have last longer, Pete, I really did. I'm sorry you didn't. Thank you for sticking around. Thank you for hanging out with us as long as you did. It was really great, dude. You know I fucking love you. E hearts for Pete people because he's fucking great people. I've known him for quite some time. He's an Australian guy. Just awesome. Awesome. Pete, you fucking rock. You fucking rock. Fuck yeah. Okay, so I uh, did my show on blog this past Friday. Um, it was a lot of fun. It was a good time. There was, you know, a select few people in there, so it made it easier to talk to people. We really didn't have too many dickheads. It wasn't too much drama. It was pretty good. And then I went live Sunday. Sunday was absolutely a madhouse. I had like close to 100 people in my room. It was insane absolutely insane but I did a nice little drunk vlog <laughs> so I did a nice little drunk vlog and uh, here it is so this is what's going on I'm up in Cinder F and Rose's room after party. Um, I went through about half a bottle of Southern Comfort, and I'm on my first beer. Drunk log vlog for the motherfucking win. Yes, I have such a good buzz going on, people. I don't even fucking care. Anyways. Hmm. So go online. Um, so yeah, I'm in Cinder F and Rose's room, and apparently all the females want to take advantage of me. Help me. Face. Uh. So there you have it, people. Um, you should definitely try to make it to my shows Friday 
8 p.m. Eastern Standard Time till about 11 p.m. Eastern Standard Time on Blog TV, right here. That's the link. Uh, I'll try to put it up in the sidebar. Come on by, it's a good time. We just chill, have fun, talk shit. It's definitely a good time. Joke around, fuck around, talk about nostalgic shit and everything, you know. So, come on by, people, you know. Great people over on blog. I, just like Stickham, you know, I do both. I don't know what's up with the hate between the both, y'all. But sit on it, rotate, I don't give a flying fuck. Yeah, I got much love for both of them, so. I think that if you're a friend over on Stickham, you should come. At least to my show, because that's what Cinder does. She, Cinder fucking hates blog TV, but she comes to my show. She shows the love, people. It's all about the love. Where is the love? Just saying. Alright. Y'all take care. Be safe. Don't do stupid shit. Don't drink and drive. Peace out, baby.